organizer who started community pantries in the country asked for help as she and other organizers are red tagged by the police. Ana Patricia non temporarily stops operations in Maginhawa, Quezon City, Tuesday, April 20. On social media, non post screenshots of Facebook posts by the Quezon City Police District and the Task Force Against Local Communists red tagging her and other groups for the initiative. Wala po akong link sa Communist Party. Malinaw yung intention ko una pa lang. Tigilan po natin yung mga ganitong uh, pagbibintang kasi napakadelikado po eh. Lalo na po sa panahon ngayon. Non appeals to Quezon City Mayor Joy Belmonte to help her with her safety and security. In a statement, Belmonte assures Non that the local government fully will ensure that organizers and beneficiaries of community pantries remain safe. Since last week, community pantries have sprouted across the country, inspired by Non's initiative in Maginhawa, which went viral on social media. But a Facebook post of Peace Philippines, a youth-led organization claiming to be advocating for peace, labels community pantries as a weapon of communists to recruit members. It also falsely accuses Tulong Kabataan, one of the organizations behind the initiative to be a front of the Communist Party of the Philippines or CPP. Kung gusto po nila itigil yung community pantry, ire- gusto na lang po nila ipagpatuloy yung red tagging, sige po gawin nyo, pero kaya nyo po bang uh, pakainin and uh, bigyan ng sapat na tulong yung mga taong to. Malacanang also says the government's anti-communism task force should not impede the work of community pantries. Sa nagsalita na po ang ating uh, um, DIG secretary at nagsalita Ito na rin po ako bilang tagapagsalita ng Pangulo na dapat walang maghahad lang doon sa mga efforts na nagbabayanihan ng ating mga kababayan. The red tagging incident causes an uproar among Filipinos online who call the move sickening. Many are upset by the misguided priorities of the government as its police attacks a grassroots movement meant to give aid during the pandemic. Non said in an interview last week that she initiated the community pantry because she was tired of government inaction. After the backlash, the QCPD apologizes for its post and reassures Non her safety and protection.